And last time in the engine room, we were done with Gold Leaf Galaxy uh, for the season. So let's move on to the water world. Even though I could actually open up the new level and skip it entirely, I uh, I don't like I don't like you or myself. So here we go, water level. Honestly, I like the Sea Slide Galaxy. It is a water level ish, but it's mm. not completely underwater. I would like to see you stand by that statement because it is 90% water. I will swim by that statement, I guess then. <laughs> it's it well it is penguin paradise, I'll give you that much. But it, it's it's a water level and there are new penguins though. Yeah, you get the multicolored penguins that they're kind of like yo Yoshi's in that regard. They each have a different power up depending on when they eat a uh, fish. And we still have the uh, standard galaxy traveling penguin, or both of them rather. And it's nice that they don't let us explore the entire level when it's just a uh, giant loop of water. No one was out beyond this point. Is that what no they one. think of you, Pink Toad? Are you the most useless one? Oh, I do see that. And I thought the ocean was like a large uh, body of water formed in the depression on the Earth, but okay. I really wouldn't describe this as an ocean. Or a sea, for that matter. It's a slide, definitely. It is the uh, endless river at your local <laughs> water park. Yes. It, it may be a lazy one, or it might be a uh, eternal one. Localize this joke. I like his speech thing. <laughs> Honestly, he doesn't look like that much of a hoopin. He looks... He's got a scar. He's probably in a gang. Wait, no, he probably dropped out of school. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay, so the gameplay of the sea slide. It's a giant, uh loop of water and there's not much you can do with it so uh, all of the gameplay involves going around in a circle in some type of race or speed fashion although we never really have to race anybody well not right now we're kind of trying to keep up we're we don't have to race we just have to move quickly through the water which is essentially the same exact input as racing it's just changing what the goal is in this case, the goal is an orange hula hoop with a number in it, and we know exactly how long it's going to take based on Why the number in the hula hoop. Gold rings and <laughs> power stones. Uh, yeah, I, I bet this guy is actually pretty slippy, if, judging by his skin. That, those steam coming out of those rocks, is not from molten lava coming into contact with the uh, surface of the water, because there is no molten lava in a sea slide. Also, I don't think trees can grow in the ocean. Uh... I... I don't know if that's wrong or not. I know trees, like palm trees, they grow on the beach, but... I don't think there's a saltwater tree. Ha. <laughs> uh... Time for my victory lap. Look at him, taking you for small fry. Now he's all washed up. Uh, Getting all up in his crew. Uh, you got him beach. Uh, he doesn't have. He doesn't have a grill. <laughs> he's a hooligan, he, of course. He's a killer whale. He doesn't have. He's a hooligan. He always has the greatest expressions during other people's talk bubbles, though. He has a perpetual smile. Mhm. Mm it's not very menacing. We're not old. <laughs> Get your penguin beak out of my eye! I am a regularly aged stash guy. I have much more to my personality than having a stash. I take offense. You're also old. I, ha <laughs> I have a stash of power stars. Oh no! Whoa. Tell me, youngster, could an old person do this? Pulls off a cool 
skateboarding trick. <laughs> Breaks the hip. Actually, I, I, I pull off a cool manta ray trick. Surprisingly, they don't make you race manta rays in this level. Which seems, <laughs> you would like just veer off to your death every single time, no, and it would be horrible. Yeah, I think maybe it might have been designed to be a racing on a manta ray level, but then they were like, no, this is difficult. There's a giant tree blocking the path. Oh, this is difficult, and manta ray surfing is really... should just be a one-time thing. Yeah, well, it isn't. It's not? No. Oh. There, there are many rays to shine down uh, well, ahead. Maybe they figured one less would be for the better. Yeah. I actually forgot for a second that Manta Rays was controlled by the Wiimote tilt. Yeah, it's not that fun of a mechanic or yeah. a minigame. Those penguins look menacing. It's like oh, that was he's a race. You out. Oh, he's asking you if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> and they are being confident about their own skills. Uh, well, they already intimidated the toads. All right, so we gotta find Coach. <laughs> oh. Coach, what? that's a, a snorkel. That's a snorkelable outfit you've got there. Oh, even the Koopas in this level look chill. <laughs> yeah, they're all maxing and relaxing. Working on my talking to that Koopa. Tan. No. Oh. <laughs> no. There, there's no NPC Koopa in this game. Instead, we're racing penguins. Is he digging up the tarp with a pickaxe? Uh, no, it's like one of those solar eclipse things. You have to look through the hole. He's trying to, uh, poke a hole in it. Get a very, uh, pinpoint tan. Did, didn't he really... Oh, okay, sure. I'm trying to block the light with the shell, and it's not working. Well, I would be terrified too. You shine above the rest, pal. Well, I guess he really is all washed up. He's not competing in the race. Okay, I'm gonna get a head start on this race. Those suckers didn't even hear the gun get fired. I don't think it this was is a pain. Right. It was a pain gun. Pe pain gun. Uh. That's that's a little tiny penguin. <laughs> it's a tiny penguin. It is just a shrunk down model of a regular penguin with a regular sized dust cloud. I think it has a smaller step sound effect though. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm glad to see they put that detail for the tiny penguin for no reason. But I also like to imagine that it was just a completely accidental sized penguin. They meant just to have another penguin there. And this penguin has eyebrows. I mean, this penguin has a shell for a face. I think it's one of those um, non-emperor penguins. I I thought I, I don't remember how many penguin types actually have eyebrows, but I think a lot of them. Uh, there's the Emperor Penguin. Emperor Penguins don't have eyebrows! The, uh... The Ga... Ga... Uh, Peng... Uh, the Galaxy Penguin? The Penguin? Uh, the Penguin... Penguins can't race very well because they can't pick up shells. It's really easy to pretty much do the same exact thing I did last time. As long as I don't bump into, uh, the Penguin, I should be fine. Uh, you can always press Z to slow down. <laughs> yes, I always can. You have to uh, break when you go into some of these hairpins. Or... I don't understand what the cyclones are, how that actually works at all. You swim right, just like that penguin demonstrated. <laughs> Apparently. Also, I go way faster on the surface here because uh, the sur the water is really weird in this level because it's not like a flat surface. They don't do that much in this game. So no ice flower racing on this level. I think it would be really, uh, really cool if I could get an ice flower to cheat in this race. Just skate along the surface instead, but then, uh... Oh, gold ring, you gotta swim through it, too. Uh... <laughs> okay, then we awesome. unlock... Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm, put I'm in the second we, one. I'm glad we got that tip from, uh, from Guppy there. And we're, we're at the finish line. There was yeah. two gold rings right at the end. <laughs> That's what needed me to make that photo finish. I think 
right when uh, the race started, everyone just swam off. Guppy actually swam over there and put those two gold rings up. Yeah, I gotta let yourself seem relevant. The penguin looks so satisfied with this power star. Here's our gold medal. This coach doesn't look anything like the other coach. This is not a coach, he's, he's, he's head racing guy. I, I am an old stash guy, apparently. Good work, old stash. Hey, but, power star, power star. So now I'm going to be his protege, and then at the very end he will reveal that he's training me to be a bad guy. Oh. I had to defeat my mentor in another swim race. I'm so f he, he's so uh, impressed. He's not even gonna look at me. He's averting his gaze. He's not worthy. He really is just digging at a tarp. Yeah, they 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 went through the trouble of making every NPC say something to the effect of congratulations, now get the power star. Don't you feel good about yourself? Oh wait, there's payment races. I should uh, enter those. So we got our uh, aquatic board right there. Gill board. Uh -huh. <laughs> Or maybe it's the vacationing board. Chill board? Oh, uh, I think we used that one in the ice level. Oh. <laughs> and with that, we've got all five Hungry Lumas of uh, the Comet Observatory actually Two taking. Starve. Yeah. I want to see. I want to like create a battle royale style situation where they have to fight for the star bits. I think they're made of star bits, so if they kill the other and eat it, it'll all work out. But some are like twenty times as hungry as the next one, so maybe it's an effect of they'll be weakened because of that, or they want it more because they're so much hungrier. I'm not a. I'm not a nutritionist or a, uh, a lumologist. Uh, this time around, we're going to collect the silver star chips. I like the silver stars in that they're like red coins. They're in specific spots and you hunt them down. They're not scattered everywhere like purple coins. Uh, they, they're essentially... I just realized that the red coins are pretty much essentially uh, star chips. Or pull star chips. Or silver stars. They all work the same thing, the same way. You go and collect five of them. But, and um, this leads, this doesn't lead up to a star, it is the star, essentially, so it's more of yeah. a coin? Yeah, it's closer, but it's still in some spectrum between them. If you had to collect eight silver stars, then I'd give you credence. But there are only five star point T things to a star? Yeah, but if you have eight, eight, you can make an eight-pointed star, I think that's called a, a, a shine. Uh, it's called a star me? Uh, I like that the silver stars follow you around. Unlike red coins. So you know your progress. Also, it looks like they're they're trying to home in on Mario's action. They're like little kid brothers of power stars. They really want to get a cutscene. Like, hey Mario, pick me up, dance with me. No, uh, uh, Mario! Uh. I... For it's a mangrove. For some reason, I thought somehow it got mixed up in my head. Mangrove sounded like a fruit to me. Mango. And I thought, yeah, I think that's what it was. And I was looking at the giant thing in the center and thinking that doesn't look much like a mango. Uh, I, I don't know. It's a type of tree that grows. Uh, yeah, in I water. got. I, is that, oh, yeah, it is. Salt water. No, but you don't. You don't know what type of water this is. Just because it's an ocean, you assume it's salty. It's a sea. But that was an ocean. Penguin. It's a sea slide galaxy. Oh. I don't think penguins live in fresh water. Maybe it. I, I'm and not I, sure if mangroves can grow on salt water. Maybe they can. I, I know that uh, killer whales can't live in fresh water. Uh, which I assume Guppy is a baby killer whale. I, 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 I know a lot of animals that don't 
live in freshwater either. Like deer? <laughs> like tigers and um uh lions and bears. Oh my And Lumas. Lumas don't live in the ocean either. I would have liked to see an underwater Luma, to be honest with you. A blue Luma that lives only underwater. But and the star bits underwater. Stars, it at you. Oh my god, it's it's a darker blue. Oh, or maybe no. it's completely clear. Yes, yeah, Ma Maybe it's they rip exist and the I don't know them yet. Uh, stop it. Wait, is the go. yellow... Has the yellow toad been doing that animation this entire time? I don't think so. I'm pretty sure he's done it before. He's asleep in... He's the one that's asleep in the galaxy. Oh, now. yeah, I guess not. Or observatory. B Mario cannot pick up a shell for some reason. I think it's because he can't fly with a shell because it's too heavy. And it would look really weird. Like, Despite flying the with a shell. You can just wall kick with a shell. Yeah, because that doesn't look weird at all. It's the, uh, it's the style. People go around holding shells so they can't use their hands. It's the new hands behind my back. I can beat you with one hand holding a shell. A shell down? Aw, oh, shucks, you beat me. I... Nah. Uh-oh. I like that you don't have to walk all the way back. Oh, oh okay. I thought I would actually have to climb this massive mangrove in a really, uh, bee-oriented way. And oh. you still do. Yeah, well, they put the clouds here, and notice that there are, there are more clouds than rain clouds. There are also, uh, uh, sun clouds. There's also Guppy. Yeah, Guppy's here. He, he doesn't go away. He's he's in it to win it. I don't think he didn't leave this place at all, so... Oh, yeah, that's gotta be a, that's gotta be a fate there. You can't even walk around on the little land there is. I wouldn't call that riding a cloud. The cloud... No. But I should just go and check to make sure, I think, while I'm out there. Yeah, it doesn't look like water at all. I gotta be... that's way too much surface tension. If it looked, like, a little bit ripply on the outside texture, it would look a lot better, I think. So now we're on a giant, massive mangrove, and I have something to prove. Now I gotta mute my sound, I take it. <laughs> Well, uh, this, there has been some contention in this Let's Play about what happens if you collect, uh, uh, these notes in reverse order or any order outside of their intended order, and I, for the liberty of argument, I have muted this section of the video so that the answer won't be spoiled to me, Blind Cat, or the viewer, Except but trust me. Except the one who recorded this. <laughs> oh, uh, what, uh, well, artistic I'll find integrity. Out everyone else. No. That I'm right. I'm pretty no. sure. Oh god. This penguin is old and gray. He doesn't have a stash though, he has a beard. <laughs> I think that makes you older. Quit abusing- Oh! That's why the penguin calls us an old stash guy. That's cause... old beard guy, so you're obviously old stash guy. Also, this is where he puts his uh, medicine pill board. No, uh, because he's old. I think that because Penguin can only associate facial hair with old age. So we have a mustache, so he must be old stash guy. And you gotta go back for the beef power up now. If I had not gotten hit by that spider, it would have been one nice cycle and loop. I wouldn't have to repeat any areas. I would have gotten this one and then been right back at the beginning to collect the power star. Uh, why don't you go explore the lighthouse first? Uh, I'm, I'm, uh, <laughs> there'll be time for that in, uh, 
in due time. There, I've only got five of the six silver stars. Oh, wait. See, that forms the gold star, but if I get one more silver star, I'll get gold plus. There we go. I think it was over there by those two crisscrossed stones. Oh, congratulations. Mm-hmm. Even the penguin's impressed somehow. Oh, okay. That is a very threatening, uh, gill there. Oh, so they are worker bees. You can tell by all the work they've never done. We're supposed to be doing something. Oh, I, I've already completely spaced. Because galaxy out. Yeah, they, they really are afraid that you're going to forget to go get the power star in this stage. Just be on vacation forever. <laughs> yes. I, I'm looking for... I picked up a silver star and then all my silver stars went away. I don't know what to do. Okay. Well, it's the end of the level. What are, what are you waiting for? Well, I better wrap it up. That, that's really river team commentary there. Uh, hope you guys subscribe to this channel. Keep up on my current events. Tributary. Well, I'll find out with everyone else that I'm right. Wrong!